Stop. There's a lot of stuff in the industry right now talking about removing metals, removing staining. I'd like to ask you to clarify some of these points because there's really some misunderstanding on how this process actually works right. okay. and as far as the metal remover products that are out there. All right. Excellent. Well, thank you for the question. Uh, metals are dissolved in water, so they're, they're what, what we call ions. And um, sequestering agents kind of coat that ion with an organic material and prevent it from staining. And chlorine will eat at that kind of organic material. That's why you've got to do a maintenance dose. Um, so those materials, those, those sequestered metals or those chelated metals, as we call it, are really small. They're under, under a micron in size. And so that's really small. Now, because the best filtration out there is what, three microns, two to three microns? Two to three, and you can put fiber in and get a little bit better, but you're never going to get below a micron. So you're never going to be able to capture ions, metal ions, dissolved metals with fiber in a filter. It is impossible. That's catching the metal. Right. But, all right, but you have a product that removes it. How does your product remove metal? Okay. So our product is really a sequestering agent bound to a polymer that does not actually dissolve in water. So it's like plastic. So it's the same binding groups that are, that are on the liquid materials, but they're attached to, to an insoluble plastic. As the water passes over it, it'll take the metals and it'll bind, the, bind, bind dissolved metals to the polymer. So we actually can remove those those kinds of materials. Now, a lot of people ask, they say, wait a minute, we, we put this fiber into the filter and we see this, this brown in the filter or we see this blue, and they're not really removing the metals. They're removing the metal oxides, which are the oxidized metals are about ready to stain the pool. They're much bigger particles and they could be captured by the filter. The problem is you're chasing a problem. You've got to capture the materials that are suspended in that water before they stain the pool. And you've got to run, you've got turnovers in the pool, you've got, you've got to run that pool filter 24 seven because that chlorine is always oxidizing the metals. So they do take metal oxide particles out, but not fast enough for you to, for you to prevent staining of the pool. So, so they're, and they're not removing metals at all that have not already reacted with chlorine. And are ready to stain your pool. 